Hey everybody, we are back again with another Looking at Toys video and hopefully you have uh, been watching our series of videos that we've done today which has of course featured the um, little shoes and of course the 700s that we've had uh, recently into our collection. So continuing with that theme, we're going to be taking a look at uh, the Quantum. These are ones that we've just had uh, two pairs come into our collection. So um, our advice from one of the last videos was of course to wait for these to go on sale. Um, we didn't actually follow our own advice and we ended up buying this particular pair from uh, StockX as it looked like they were down to what was a um, pretty decent price there. Um, so we ended up paying £110.50p. Adidas put these up for 110 so we're out of pocket by 50p um but it was good advice that we gave obviously to wait for them we didn't follow it we, we paid a bit more for them um but um quantums this is what we're going to be taking a look at now so um as we are um buying these for collection we weren't really too bothered um about the size that we got and of course we weren't too bothered about the colorway it was more the fact that we wanted a pair of quantums in our collection. Um, we have actually got the um, the proper basketball uh, version of these incoming as well. So I guess we will do a video where we compare the two um, as well. So if you are new to collecting um, and some more good advice from us, um, let's go for sort of the bigger sizes if it's a pair that you're not going to wear. Um, we wouldn't generally buy anything that was smaller than a size US 9 maybe um, and there wouldn't really be a, sort of an upper limit as to what we wouldn't uh, consider. Um, if you're new to collecting don't bother with the smaller sizes. Um, if you're going to wear them fair enough but if, you, if you're not going to wear them you just want them for your collection they don't tend to have any sort of significant resale value uh, generally speaking that is of course um, and of course if you're doing a collection you know you, you do want to know that you've got some residual value in um, what you've got there. So. These quantums are heel blue. And sort of was uh, done as a, a basketball shoe and obviously a, a lifestyle version as well. This is the uh, lifestyle version. I do really like the colorway on these. And obviously, actually this pair is not too bad, camera guy. The three things there do sort of match up um, but if you go back to the other side as you can see it's slightly out there but um, I'm always amazed with uh, this particular shoe um, Kanye's obviously um, design team there they've just used so many different uh, materials in this so we've got suede at the front uh, this breathable material on the side uh, and this sort of plastic on the back there and whatever this it's like neoprene isn't it what they make um, diver suits out of uh, on the front there. So this particular pair is a UK 10 from 2020. So already four years old, um, but I guess as it's come from StockX, it could well have been, well, who knows how long somebody's had it for. These were StockX, weren't they, camera guy? Or was it, yeah, no, yeah, it's good to be StockX, isn't it? And then of course we've got the other one there as well but uh, this is sort of the um, the general shoe um, one that you should be looking to get into your collection um, is of course the actual uh, basketball uh, version mm -hmm. um, which obviously is slightly different and of course we will do a uh, video um, on that once we have got it in but yeah as you can see StockX verified there um, so it's worth buying sometimes from StockX. Obviously, we sell on StockX. Obviously, our website as well, eBay. Um, but you know, I, I feel we've got a, a good price on those. Obviously, I had a lot of my advice. Could say uh, got them from Adidas. So this is the pair uh, that we got from uh, Adidas, and these are the Onyx ones, UK ten as well. So this is a pair which I think I'm going to just keep and uh, wear uh, myself, which is why I've sort of gone for the, um, the black colorway. Put them two side by side there. Top or bottom. 
Actually, they don't look too bad, do they? Actually, can look out when you put them sort of like that. Shall I do um, what people do these days and uh, do that? Is that like a double flex these days, camera guy? No, it won't look good on me. Too old for it. <laughs> You're gonna do it. You too old as well. Okay, well, perhaps if you were uh, a 13 year old teenager and you wanna do uh, a double big flex, um, then obviously what you might choose to do is wear the two different uh, shoes, uh, just to show off the fact that you've got two pairs of them. Um, but I think that's an absolutely fantastic design. I uh, really like the styling on these. Um, I might just buy a third pair, camera guy. Are you going to tell me to show some restraint in uh, buying stuff? So we are adding to our um, Yeezy collection. Uh, and um, We have got a number of additional pairs uh, incoming, uh, which do include uh, a couple of the US uh, exclusives. Uh, we've actually um, have hopefully just completed the uh, purchase of the uh, 750 and um, we're still on the hunt for a 1050. Um, we sort of were in talks but um, it doesn't look like that particular pair um, is one that we're going to be able to um, make make a deal on um, but um, yeah we were cash ready to, to get them but a couple of bits haven't, haven't worked out there and uh, so our channel looking at toys does of course feature loads of rare and collectible items um, obviously we're giving tips as well on um, you should be getting into your collections um, as well so uh, do be sure to subscribe to our channel drop your comments down below and um, do be sure to subscribe to our channel we will catch you on the next video which will hopefully feature some uh, something a little bit different some of the rarer Yeezys uh, that we have got coming into our uh, our collection